We are headed out of this little town, Basa Basa Asachi. Basa Asachi. Basa Asachi. I'm close. Hopefully, I'm close. Hotel for the night, 900 pesos, 40, uh, 45 or <clears throat> 45 or 50 dollars. Great stop. We rode as far as we could yesterday to get as close as we could to the town of Creel, and we are only about two hours, two and a half hours away. From there, we'll be exploring Copper Canyon. There we go. Let's get the heck out here. That cow guard is freaking a little bit excessive. We will make a quick stop to see the falls. This town does sit at 6,500 feet in elevation. So it is much, much cooler than the temps we were experiencing yesterday at about 100 degrees Fahrenheit. It was 65 when I woke up today and we might see a high of 80 possibly today. So a substantial difference. Here we are. Might as well walk down to the waterfall since we're here. It's only about a five minute walk. It's quiet. No one else is here besides the locals. The little restaurants are open, the shops are open. The only ones <laughs> in the parking lot. These waterfalls better be something else. It's been all downhill since we left the parking lot. So going back up won't be fun. Sketchy suspension bridge coming up. see if I can spot the falls. If not, I'm headed back to the bikes. We still have about a two to three hour ride. Looks like I am coming up to something. I think this was worth the 10 minute walk down from the parking lot. side. start making my way back to the bike we should be arriving in Creel within two to three hours back at the sketchy suspension bridge easy going down not so easy going back up it's all uphill to the parking lot I really should have brought some water with me back up it's a very short hike from the parking lot to get down there and up not bad at all if you really want to see those waterfalls cranking June is the beginning of the rainy season and you're towards the end of the fall those waterfalls should be cranking there's a couple of restaurants a few little gift shops 
Just some random knickknacks. But we better get rolling out of here. And we're off. Speed bump. Ooh. We are headed to Creel. Should be an interesting route all the way. Plenty of mountain twisties. And we are about to find out of the road condition. Yesterday, it was a fantastic route. The views were spectacular, but as soon as we hit Chihuahua, and the potholes, the potholes were something else. We have to keep an eye out. Chihuahua is 276 kilometers away from this little town. Well, they're saying 127 kilometers, right? How many miles is that? I, I might grab gas really quick, you know? I got 100 miles clocked. Ah, uh, shit. Should I? Was there a gas station right here? Hold on. Alright. You know what? Why don't, if, you don't, if you're good on gas, why don't you keep going? And I'll, I'll catch up with you. Alright? Just go your pace and I'll just haul ass. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, don't wait for me and come back and I'll, I'll see you up the road. I didn't realize how far Krill is still, 127 kilometers. I should probably fill up just to be safe. I'm gonna head back to that gas station on the, well now on the right, that was on the left coming down, and top the bike off. Dos horas, dos horas, tres horas, máximo. Paso lento como dos horas hasta Cría. Ajá. Sí, dos horas, pasa, pues ahí, más o menos. Pero máximo una hora cuarenta, no tres horas. Mm-hmm.